It's so interesting that Mr. Braun keeps referring to my party in D.C. I wasn't in D.C. I've never served in D.C. He is the gentleman who has been serving us in D.C. for a long time now. He is definitely an insider in Washington, D.C. And what did you get accomplished? I mean, obviously, you voted against a very, very popular bipartisan bill. And a lot of people, the perception here from Hoosiers is you were playing politics. And, I, and that's unfortunate because we need solutions. Illegal immigration is a huge topic that we need solved at the federal level. Now, obviously, there are ways to do that. And as the governor, I will certainly cooperate with the federal level, um, regardless of who the president of the United States is, because I want Hoosiers to be safe. And we also need to address the issue. But as far as legal immigration goes, we embrace that. There are 6% of our population that are here in the workforce, bringing over $4 billion into our economy. Many of our communities are dependent upon immigrants who have come here legally and being very, very productive citizens. But as a responsible governor, I will make sure we get resources where they need to go. Mr. Braun, same question to you here. How will you address the influx of legal migrants in some of our communities and resources that may need to come from the state? 60 seconds. So legal immigration is something that you all need more of it. And the reason we haven't gotten it is because you've got a porous border. Again, unless she wants to disavow everything her party stands for, that's what's been in the way of it. But this country was built upon immigration, legal immigration, not open borders. And that issue is right up there with the economy, and they're both bad, and they've both been put upon us by the Biden-Harris administration. So when we have legal immigration, and it's in our own state, of course you support it. That's what we need more of. What we need less of is what uh, my opponent and her party have given us in the first place, which is open doors, and that was working well before Biden and Harris got elected. Now all states are border states, and we're putting up with the complications of it.